Dudes and dudettes of YouTube land, it's Frank with What's the Point EDC. Today we got us a very cool one. We got the Microtech Annex to talk about today. It was asked of me to do a full in-depth review of this knife, so we're going to go ahead and do a What's the Point EDC style of overview. Let's go ahead and get into it. This is the box, looking awesome. This knife was OEM'd by Reich. So this one was made in China. But my God, it's OEN by Reich, so you know it's going to be full-on perfection. Look at that. You can read that if you want. Pause the screen. This thing right here is so good, you guys. And as you can see, the Chinese, um, it gives Chinese vibes. Not, and I don't say that in a bad way. I mean that in a good way because it's done by Reich. Got a nice sticker here. Here's your pamphlet right here. It's got some stuff inside of it. There's that. Look at here, y'all. Look at the presentation you get when you get this. Let's go ahead and take everything out real quick. This thing is so nice. And I got to say, the presentation and the, the quality of this box is freaking fire, you guys. One thing that was asked of me very recently was, what are those metal things coming out of the bottom of the knife? Those are lanyards right here. These are titanium. Look at how this one's milled. You see through that? That is incredible, right? That is so cool. This is something that's like a, uh, it's a Marfion type thing and a Microtech type thing. It's kind of what they do. You know, they, they do different style and they do odd things. And Reich, if you know about Reich knives, they do this type of stuff too. So it's just a little something unique and something cool. This right here is going to be for your hardware. It's proprietary hardware. So you just do it just like that right there. And you'll screw it and unscrew it. The little one right here, we'll flip her over real quick. See right here. Just like that, very simple. Not much to it at all. Let's go ahead and move this out the way now that we got that established. Microtech Annex, full DLC. Looking freaking awesome, you guys. Nice cross-cut carbon fiber inlay. Seamless transition. Full titanium integral handle. The frame is full, one piece. Very strong. Very well machined out. Look at that pocket clip. It's got that globe that I talk about. This thing is just done very well. Look at the quality of this. That DLC is so good. Matter of fact, before we go any farther, I want to screw in this uh, one of the lanyards just so I can show you guys what it looks like real quick. Yeah. And whenever you have the lanyard on and you deploy the knife, it gets a wiggle. It gets a lot of wiggle out of this one right here. And it feels very cool and very unique. You see how it wiggles when I do that? Very cool, very unique. Look at the action on that. It's got caged ceramic ball bearings, and it just does what it does. Nice, big, tall blade with nice fullers on both sides. M390 steel. Look at that action. Nice and snappy out. Nice and smooth in. Very good edge geometry on this. I'm talking superb edge geometry. This knife right here, you can't ask for a better knife. It's just well done. I had to wipe it off for you guys real quick. And the machining is top notch. It is just a solid knife all around. Look up inside there, y'all. Just one piece of straight up awesomeness. Marfion Customs did this right here. And there's a guy named Jim Skelton. You can go check his video out and he will. Uh, you'll see his Marfion Custom of the Annex. So this is just the production version of it, and this itself is so good. I'm talking, this is an amazing knife. You can get good grips on it like this. Look how your thumb just goes and wraps around it. Very good, you guys. Let's go ahead and flip it over and hold it like this. We want to choke up. We can hold it like this. We can hold it like this for good draw cuts. It's a good stabber. It's a good slicer. It's a good push cutter. It's all that stuff right there. Very, very fidgety too. For what it is, it is super fidgety and super satisfying. I should say it's more satisfying than anything. The way it's satisfying, drop shut. Look at that. You can almost control how slow it drops. Once you tilt it to the side after it uh, goes past the lock. Oh man, that thing is so nice, you guys. Very recommendable knife. Very hard use knife if you actually want to use it for hard use tasks. It's just done right, you guys. It's a solid one. This right here is a grail. It's it's a grail. And this is amazing that I can even sit here and play with this knife. I want to show you guys something really cool. You ready? Look at this nice. 
Front flip action, y'all. Jeez, Louise. That is awesome. Look at the size of that nice blade. Man, I can't wait to freaking... I got a cut test I'm going to do with this. And uh, I'm very interested to see how it does. I know it's going to be very comfortable in hand. I have cut things with it. I haven't cut a whole lot. Uh, this right here to me is more... Uh, it's more or less... Is, it's like a chilling piece, a show piece. I am going to use it. And I carry it often for sure and I, I do lots of pictures with it i got pictures i don't even upload i just got pictures and pictures <laughs> it's a very nice knife you guys look at that how that swedge comes i'm not swedge how you got the fullers that come in to see how the tip oh man look how the tip right here from this point forward is crowned so nice nice acute tip on this thing wow i mean it's just beautiful this uh this dlc coating is fire y'all Definitely slight fingerprinting, but it is definitely fire. What do you guys think about this? This is just awesome grailness right here. This is amazing. Still to this day, every time I touch it, every time I hold it, it just gets better and better and better. This knife has never let me down at all. It's just that daggone good, you guys. I appreciate everybody who's came here and everybody who supports the channel. Everybody who stops by this to see what I'm doing here and put a like and a comment in. You guys are awesome. Without you guys, there would be no WTP. So with that being said, if you're an addict, never quit quitting. Stay strong and live long. Get the help you deserve so you can live your best life. And if you're struggling with bad thoughts, reach out and talk to somebody. It is okay to talk. Never quit quitting and never give up. You know what time it is here. Sharp knives and good vibes only. Take it easy and stay greasy, my peeps. I am out. Microtech Annex for the win.